welcome to my channel. My name's Ali and I have no idea what that intro was about. In today's video I'm going to be talking about chickens and ducks and which one makes the best pet. Not which ones would win the fight. Although I do know this, it would definitely be chickens. So getting back to this video, I'm probably not going to be answering which one makes the best pet either because it's entirely subjective which one is the best. It all depends on your requirements, your needs, your lifestyle. But I'll go into a few of the main differences between ducks and chickens. So first one is space. Chickens require less space than ducks. According to the RSPCA website, Chickens require a 12 square metre per 30 chickens, which works out that it's 0.4 metres squared per chicken, which isn't a lot of space at all. Now, ideally, you want to be giving them much more than the bare minimum because they want to be able to perform their natural behaviours, which is scratching, the, scratching around, foraging, pecking the floor, all that kind of thing. You want to provide them as much space as you can, although they do technically need less space than ducks. Ducks, according to that website, require 1.5 metres squared per duck. So that's a lot more space per individual duck, which I actually would agree with. Ducks do actually need quite a bit more space than chickens. But Either way, try and give your chickens more than the bare minimum. Next main difference is sleeping accommodation. With chickens, they like to roost and they like a perch bar because they roost off the ground. Whereas with ducks, they don't require that. They actually sleep on ground level. So if you've got a duck house and it's similar to a chicken house, take out the roosting bars because they don't need them. The next difference is water. With chickens, they just need water to drink. They don't need it to bathing, they just need it to drink. So you can have a poultry water dispenser, that'd be perfect for them. Whereas ducks, they definitely need water water for drinking and they also need a water bowl that they can get into and it needs to be deep enough for them to, to submerge their whole head. The reason for this is is that in order to clean their bill and their eyes they need to be able to submerge their whole head. Ideally you want a pond for them but you don't necessarily have to have a pond. You can use a children's paddling pool mess. Chickens are easier to clean up than ducks. Their poo is semi-firm and they seem to do far less poo whereas ducks their poo is quite soft and loose and smells really really bad and they seem to poo a hell of a lot more than chickens. So if you had to give me a choice between cleaning a chicken house and a duck house chicken house all the way. Destruction. Chickens and ducks are about the same for this. With chickens they will scratch the ground so if you have them in an area uh, with grass in that's not overly big they will just make the, the whole area bare um, because they'll scratch all the grass up. Ducks, on the other hand, they don't scratch the grass so much, but what they do is they tend to trample on it, and that combined with the mess that they make, the poop, it can create a swamp pit from hell. Oh, what is it? The bog of eternal stain. Egg production. Chickens generally lay more eggs than ducks. Some of my chickens will lay eggs all year round. Um, there is an exception to the rule though, which is khaki Campbell ducks. Khaki Campbells will actually lay, can lay up to 280 eggs a year, which is actually more than most chickens. So there is exceptions to the rule, but generally speaking, 
chickens might lay more eggs than ducks. Ailments. Chickens seem to be more susceptible to disease and illnesses. Um, they're more susceptible to mites and just generally they just seem to be a little bit more fragile than a duck. Ducks, I've had much more problems with diseases and I've had red mites with my chickens which has been a nightmare to actually cure. Um, whereas my ducks don't seem to have any problems ever really. Temperament. I see sometimes people online say that chickens are not very social, they're quite aloof, they don't really want to interact with humans, but I find that's really not the case, it depends on which breed you get. My Brahmas are some of the sweetest, friendliest chickens there are. Um, they know, the breed is actually known as gentle giants of the chicken world. Um, they're super, super sweet. Um, ducks are very, very social and they are super comical. They do the most silliest things. They're so much fun to watch. They all have individual personalities and yeah, they're just great. And finally, which do I prefer? Well, the answer to this is even though they need more space, even though they're messier and smellier, even though they require a pond and extra water, even though they can be silly sometimes, even though they don't lay as many eggs, it would be ducks for me, just because I have owned them the longest and I cannot imagine my life without a couple of ducks waddling around my, my garden. They are such comical creatures and I love them to death. I love my chickens, but if I had to pick, I would have to have my ducks. I think I'm going to have to have ducks in my life for the rest of my life because they are so special to me. They have a special place in my heart.